Hi everyone, this is Michelle, Learning to Be Thin. Haven't made an update in quite a while. I um, wanted to fill you in on what's been happening with my band. Uh, I was banded in February of 2011 with the Real IC band. And um, many of my updates, I've called it a lap band. There, it's not, it's a Real IC band. So, lap band is made by Allergen, and Real IC is made by another company. So, I haven't gone for a fill since my year checkup in February. I think I went back in March and I had two CCs taken out because I felt like I was a little too tight. Well, I haven't gone back since March. I had one appointment that I just completely blew off um, because I forgot about it. And then now we are in June. So, I've, in the whole year and a half of having a band, I've skipped one appointment. And um, as of late, I was having issues with um, taking two or three bites of food, having to stop for about 10 minutes before I could start eating again because the pain was horrendous. It hurt me in my back. It hurt me in my chest. Um, I was having reflux. Um, there was a lot of things happening and I couldn't understand what was going on because I hadn't you know, had my band messed with since March, and then all of a sudden this stuff starts. Well, back in March when I felt like my band was a little tight, they took out two CCs, right? Um, and they probably should have taken out more because my band was way too tight. And after doing some research with my doctor, it looks like maybe my band, my band was up to one full CC from six CCs to seven CCs back in July. 2011 and when I look at my weight loss pretty much stalled when my band became too tight which is typical you do not lose weight if your bands too tight you can't because um, you know your body's hungry you want to eat so you choose food that you can eat and you may not be mentally making that choice uh, but you choose the food that will be a slider food around your band uh, you have so much more control over your band when it's not that tight. So when I went into my doctor, um, she just straight up said to me, she said, you know what, everyone, you know, we're, we, they just released information about the Real IC band that they figure it should not be filled. The people with the most success should not have more than six or six and a half cc's max in their band. I know there's real I see people out there who have bands that are fuller and they're having success. The average person should not have between six and a should not have more than six and a half cc's in their band. Um, she said that once you start causing issues with you're not losing weight, she said it's our fault. It's the doctor's fault that people think that you're not losing weight, so you have to get it tighter. You're not losing weight, so you have to get tighter. When in actuality, you probably should be loosening up a little bit if you're not losing weight because you're choosing the wrong foods. Your choice options have been limited so much that you can't achieve a full feeling and you can't achieve true, true hunger. You just are constantly trying to keep up with a calorie intake and therefore choosing the wrong food. So since my band has been too tight, it snowballed. It went from being too tight to being irritated because I was abusing it, to irritated to being swollen, to where I was having reflux, and it just built up into a huge problem. So here I am, two days now after taking out two and a half cc's out of my band. They thought I had 7.8. When they pulled everything out of my band, I had 8.2 in my band. So they pulled out two and a half cc's, I'm now below six. Um, I'll go back in in four weeks, but we're giving my band a little bit of time to relax a little bit after all the trauma that I was causing it by trying to eat when I actually couldn't eat and uh, this distress. Um, I've already lost two pounds in two days just being from the fact that I can't eat now. And um, I'm hungry. I'll give you that. I'm having true sensations of hunger. But I had breakfast at 9 o'clock. It's now 12.30. And yeah, I should be hungry. It's lunchtime. So yay. I feel like, I feel like I'm, I'm making progress with it. And 
I can go, yesterday I had, I sat down and ate the biggest meal that I've eaten in six months yesterday with no pain, no suffering. I ate it, I stopped and I was full. I felt in total control yesterday. Um, when I say big lunch, what I had was I had a nice sized salad in a soup bowl. Okay, that's a salad for me. So it was one cup of lettuce, I had beets in it, I had some goat's cheese, and a little bit of a vinaigrette, okay? And then I had a few walnuts on top of that. And then I had two cheese sticks and two rolled up pieces of lunch meat. That was my lunch. I was stuffed afterwards. And I was so excited because before, I would take three bites of a cheese stick and be miserable. So, of course I was choosing the wrong food. Chocolate had become a staple in my diet. Um, so had um, high calorie drinks and uh, protein shakes, and if you're living on protein shakes and chocolate, it's not the way to go. So, I'll keep you updated on how this goes, guys. I In one month, I have another adjustment. We'll see if they want to add a little bit more, but um, if I feel like I'm in control and I'm journaling and keeping track of everything, I will um, continue with this and not overfill my band, because... Uh, it just feels so good not to have that pressure in my chest when I'm eating and just all the negative crap that restriction supposedly has. If that's restriction, I don't want it because it was horrible. Horrible. Felt out of control. Didn't like it. I want to work with my band. I don't want my band to work against me. So, um, for all of you out there that are trying to achieve restriction, Think about it. Maybe that's not actually what you want. Maybe you want to have choices in your food menu. You want to have variety. You want to be able to say, I'm eating a hundred, a less than 1,200 calories a day, between a tw 11 to 1,200 calories a day. I'm eating between 60 and 80 grams of protein. I'm eating less than 30 grams of fat. And I'm journaling. And I'm exercising. Maybe that's all you need to do. Let the band control the hunger. Let the band stop you from being stupid. But don't let the band stop you from eating healthy. Okay, guys? All right. Remember, Realize C Band, they're recommending no more than six and a half cc's in it. If you have a Realize C Band and you're having issues, talk to your doctor, guys. Bye.